Good morning, Soul Squad. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome to another, another morning thoughts. I like to know, you know, what are you guys doing? How was your weekend? You know what I'm saying? But before we get started, I'm going to let you guys look. I got a special guest here on Morning Thoughts. Hi, This so is New Squad. Life Journey, a.k.a. Yeah. my sister Tia. And before we get Morning Thoughts started here, what I always say here, and I, and, and I actually said it this morning, as well, I'm going to say it again because I'm on here with you guys. Because if you don't say it nowhere else, if you ain't say it in a month, a week, a day or two, you're going to say it today when you look at what? My morning thoughts. And I'm going to say, I'd like to thank God for waking us up, spending another day with my family and friends. Because that long clock didn't mm -hmm. wake you up. He did. Mm -hmm. Can I get an amen? Amen. Amen. Yes. Amen. 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 So, guys, I really don't have much to talk about. I mean, let me just say this. Life is always good because God wake you up every day. And just like I say in these morning thoughts, you know, you didn't get up on your own. Mm -hmm. No matter how you think you did it or your child came in that room and woke you up or somebody called out your name or your phone rung and it woke you up, honey, that was God. He'll find out every he'll find out if he wants you woke, he's gonna find every way to get you up. Definitely. But you're going to think one thing, but trust and believe it was him. And, and and with that being said, me and my sister had a safe, uh, had a safe trip. We went to, um, uh, we went to, um, mm -hmm. Philly, um, on Friday, we had a safe road trip there, Sunday. regardless of the crazy driving. <laughs> <laughs> and not our crazy driving. People on the road. The people on the road crazy driving. I don't know why everybody got licenses, but you know, God saw us there. You know, we had a safe trip. He he led us back home, and and now we here. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, everything is good. I mean, well, everything that's been going on these last couple of months in our life and stuff, and still adapting to the new changes that that's forever here. Yeah. Um, he's been strong through it all. He has made us strong through it all, and you know, and the blessings. That's just been falling upon us, and you know, in abundance. It, 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 it has been in abundance, yeah. And and, and, and just, I just want to let you know, let him know that I am so grateful. Look, just because I get on here and I say things about God, don't think, oh, she only talk about him on Mondays, or she she only no, baby, I talk about him every day to myself. I be sitting on toilet talking to him. Yeah, too much information, no, but it, but, but it's true. Much. Wherever. It's, it's whatever, no, 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 and I ain't gonna say that it's a 24 hour thing all day long, but it's whenever he hit my heart. You know, whenever I get a, I, I'll be in the bathroom and I just get it, I just get, I just get this feeling that I gotta say something to him and I just say it. And like I said, like I said, I ain't gonna never say that I wasn't never into the man upstairs because I always believed in him, but mm -hmm. it's just like, recently in the last six six months or so it's like what everything has been going on it's like i just been given more faith you know and i've been trying to get a more understanding of who he is and and how we became who we are and and, and the miracles that he could work in your life yes. so i just been you know i just been trying to teach myself or get a more understanding uh one of our soul scribes sent us a quote book a book of quotes, um, and I misplaced mine. So, uh, T, that's going to tell you, I know you still got yours, and I was enjoying reading that book, and I, I miss, I, look, don't blame it on my, on me, the heart. I just, I'm not an organized person. I'm the first to admit, to admit that very unorganized, and I misplaced mine, and I really love, and I, and I was starting to enjoy the quotes, you know, um, that was in the book. It was like, it was like a Bible verse book with different verses, different meaning, different quotes with different chapters and, um, lines and stuff of the Bible. And I think when you're new to trying to discover, um, God mm -hmm. and everything, I thought that was a nice breakdown it was, so it that is. you won't feel overwhelmed by things. the Bible and the understanding and everything. So I thought it was a nice breakdown. Uh, you could find something, it was something in there that was related to either your life or life situation or what you're going through. And so I'm going to see if they got that book on Amazon. I'm going to get the name for Tiggs. I said the other day and I forgot, but now that she's sitting here, I could say I want to get that book name so I could see if it's on Amazon and stuff like that because you know it's in my car. I keep it in my car because keep it in your car. 
Yeah, because I had my, my night prayers right here, my night and day prayers, and I'd be my evening prayers. Okay. So you do your, so you, you see, she do something I don't do. I, um, I don't do night prayers. So you do your night prayers? This is, uh, um, when I was going the other day, last about two weeks, it's been about I'm almost two weeks, I was just going through and I was like, I need something to 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 help me. So this is what I do. I'm on day eight. Mm -hmm. Day eight and it's like it is they give it to me and I say this oh, all versus devotion. Yeah, and I I did it, I already read it, but I'm gonna read it again because I wasn't I wasn't in my space to really read it to the fact that I you really read it out loud to us now? Mm mm. Oh. Uh. I said I'm gonna read it. Inspirations and prayers. Yeah, inspiration okay. and prayers. It is the open morning prayers. It's called morning prayers. Verses. Oh, okay. And then I'm, and where can someone get that if they were interested in them? It's 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 verses. I see. It's it's an app. What's the name of this app? KJV Bibles. KJ who? KJV Bible. Okay, so it's KJV Bibles. Yeah, it's, it's, in, on, um, it's in the um, Apple Store. It's in the Apple Store. You probably can find it in the Android Store too, yeah, most yeah. likely. So if you would just want to be like, without well, have to carry around a whole Bible or something small that you misplace what you do, yeah. um, you can download that app. No promotion here. And I, cause I'm just learning about this from her. And I, I think I'm going to download it. Have to be, um, yeah, it's, it's really nice, and it, even though I, I use that and I do my morning prayer, I pray all I, I notice I pray all during the day, like right. more now than ever. I used to pray or say little stuff, but I really, really do it now. They yeah, really do it now because yeah. it's like I feel a difference that he has made in my life, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I mean, um, I, I really have, I have, I feel this difference. And some people say, no, YouTube is not the place for this. But guess what? YouTube is a place to talk about how I'm feeling about God and how I feel like the changes that he's made, he, he's made in my life and how he has wrapped me, uh, wrapped me and make me feel warm when I talk about him, make me feel excited when I talk about him. Because there are a lot of YouTube is, is so much stuff on YouTube. And I guess people are not used to me talking about God on my channel. Just like they say, children are not supposed to have religions in school and all that stuff like that. But right now, like, this is my platform. So when I'm on this platform, I can pretty much say what I want to say because this is my channel. This is my platform. And if you go look up YouTube, there's a lot of YouTube channels that's inspirational and talk about God and the Bible and verses. Yes, their channel is dedicated to that. But, you know, I'm just learning... I'm just learning how to accept him into my life. I am just learning how to, you know, live by the will of God. There's nothing you know? wrong with you trying to learn about God on, on your channel. This yeah. is what you do. Yeah. This is what you like. It helps you. It helps you. It's, it's helping you grow. It's helping you open up your mind and you're enjoying it. And it makes you feel better. It makes me feel Anything better. Anything that makes you feel better is good. Yeah. Anything make you feel better is good, and I and and, and it do, and I can, and I can actually, actually, I can see the difference in in my walk and in my talk. And when I when I say feel a different, I'm not talking about like I'm literally like in my walking, but the way I'm stepping saying. into life, mm -hmm. the way I'm well, the way the way the way I, you're accepting life, the way I'm life. accepting life changes in mm -hmm. the direction that I'm trying to turn my you, life into. The way you're going, you like you like the way you like the journey you're being sent on while you're getting closer to God. Yes, thank. You. I couldn't say I love that journey that I'm being sent See, on look, as I get closer time. to God, and that's what you learn. That's yeah. what I'm. That's how I know what to say because I'm learning. Like I'm learning things. Like I'm really, really learning and understanding the things. And I'm not gonna say I'm perfect. Oh as, no, no. As far as learning the word of God or learning right. what to say or how to say it, I you I and I do choose my words wisely. But when I do, when I choose them, I try to make sure I have an understanding of the words that That's I use. That's right, right. And saying, saying something that I don't know. Right, right. And when, I, and when I say it and I feel it, I know I'm saying it right. Right. So that make me continue saying it. Like right now, I know what I'm saying it is right. And I feel it all through me right now because it's like, yes, you're saying it right. You're presenting it right. And I feel good that feel I'm saying good. it. And I'm going to tell you one thing. It is the most best feeling ever to have when you talk about God and when you try to live by God and when you try to yes. try to accomplish the things that you want and then know the fact that he's not judging you. Yes. He don't hold it against you. Yes. He perceive that everybody is the same no matter mm -hmm. if you're rich or poor. And yes. I shall look at everybody the same. That's why when I go in the go in my store in the morning 
and I talk about how people will never know where they've been at, and they always download people who come there who be wanting stuff, and I be like, yes. you never know where you'll wind up at, you never know when you'll be, so don't look down on the next person, just try to help them. That's yes, good, that's, that's and that's one thing where I say that, now, God, people, we all, all people, people put people in categories. God don't put you in the category. No, he don't. No, he, he don't. don't put you in the category. No. He don't care if you homeless on the street. He don't care if you're a billionaire and you got money coming from this way, that way. He loves us equally and the same. We are one. He don't care if you black, you purple, you white. He has one thing. We are children of God. And that's what he don't categorize us. He don't say, oh, you white, you're black, you're purple, you're Chinese, you this, you that. So I, I got to treat you different. I got to do this different. We all on one accord when it comes to him. Yeah. He don't treat you different, no different because you got less or you got more. We are all equal parts of this man. And, and that's and that's what we all got to try to learn and live in society that we are all equal. Excuse you know, uh, one mm -hmm. person having more than the next person doesn't define you. It no, doesn't it make you better because at the end of the day, we all going to the same place. The one place that we all want to get to and want to be with, we all want to be with our father. The everlasting father, not the father that gave, not the father that laid down with your mom and the father that helped but bring you into this world, but the father of stairs. We all try and live our life and we all go in the same direction. Have you ever yeah. noticed when you downgrade somebody or mistreat somebody, how stuff goes so wrong in your well, life? You, yeah. But when you treat that person just as equal and, and treat them as equal and try to be and help them or whatever, life goes so much better. Life goes so much better. If you really honestly sit back and watch it and pay attention to how you used to be and to how you are now and notice the things around you, you'll notice, hey, I've been doing it wrong all this time. Yes. I am so glad I started doing it. He will this. enlighten I'm you. So, yeah, I'm so glad I'm not doing yes. this. I'm so glad I'm doing You will really, truly understand. You will and really, truly understand. understand. And that's when you know and you will discover that you're walking within God's light. When you, you're walking within the footprints in a journey that he set for you. I always say this in this channel. You know, all of us like to take control of every situation. But it's some no situations that we can't control. Can't and then control, when we try yeah. to take control of situations, we may miss that opportunity that God has shined that light upon you. But I'm going to say this. If he just don't do it once. Because one thing is that he 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 don't give up on you. He don't, he wait until you're ready. But you have to know when you're ready. Don't let no, and then I'm going to tell you this. Don't let what we saying, don't let this morning thought when I talk about God and Jesus and the, and the presence that he has brought into my life. Don't let this make you feel pressure. Don't make this thing because I'm talking about this. Oh, I, I better go get ready. You will know when you know. Your time will come when your time will come. Some people aren't ready at the same time. Some people not supposed to be ready no. at the same time. We all get our deliverance. Mm -hmm. At and different times, time. at different moments. I, so, yeah, yeah somebody I may get it time. today. Yeah, somebody may get it today by just watching this. You have, you probably can't look at so many of my morning thoughts, so many on how I'm feeling, how I'm, how I feel with this man. And you may not have gotten it, but guess what? You could be the same person who has looked at all these morning thoughts, and but look at this particular one today, and it hits you. Yeah, and, it, and that's, and it that's, hits a, that's you. another thing. You never know when it's going to happen. You Sometimes never it know. takes a crisis for something to happen. Sometimes it just has to just come to you. It took it took me to go through what I went through with my mom and going yes. through my family to yes. make me realize. Yes. You got to be closer to God. That's, and, that's, and, and, that's and that's when our sad, revelation. But it's the truth. Yes. That's when our revelation came to us. That's when we decided or that's when we felt I the felt. difference in our step and in felt. our journey. That's I when I felt. That's when my heart decided to give more faith. That's when to I felt. God. That's when I felt me started talking and yeah. reading more and feeling more. And when I read it, when I read it, I'm gonna say when I when I read it, yeah, it made me feel it. It made me feel a certain way, and that's and from there I just take it from there. Yeah, just took it from there, I and that's it what it there. was. It was the passing of my mother. That 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 really? took me into this tra into this um transition into having faith and believing that God made this decision based on what was best for my mom, mom. based on what was best for us, and I couldn't be angry, upset, but I was 
because you know we you can human. always be angry but, we fed, human. but you right. understand yes you understand where he was coming from you understand why he did it yes you have a better understanding and long as you have a better understanding you'll be all yeah by losing all. such an important family member for us it, it transcend it transcend us you know what i'm saying it mm -hmm. transcends us into a into a different outlook, into a better faith. Now, I ain't saying I'm better than nobody. Hell no, I ain't better than nobody. But I'm just saying it transcends my life as far as like having faith. You know what I'm saying? Thinking mm -hmm. more of God, having more conversations. Now, don't get it twisted. I have always prayed or talked. I always mm -hmm. say people, I really don't know what not. I was praying, but I always had a conversation. But I, I, I will always do it when I wanted something. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I will always do it when I wanted something, when I needed something, versus that now mm -hmm. I do it just because. Because this is because you need to do it. Because, because I just said you got to understand it. Yes. And, you, and you know it's something that you need to do. Yeah, it's, I know it's, it's something place, that I need to do. It's a it's place. It's a place that you want to be. You want to yes. be closer to God. You yeah, it's a place that way. I want to... Uh, that, that, and it's, that, and it's yeah. okay. It's, it's okay. okay. Everybody and, 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 don't do everything yeah. right then and there. It takes time. And it we all time. do that. We all do that. We all come call upon God or call upon Jesus at a time of crisis, you know, in our life. And it's nothing wrong with that because this is what he's there for. We are his children. He are here. He's here to protect us, to uplift us, to give us strength, to give us, make us overcome. But we all tend to only do it when we need something. And, and that's why I say I believe that we transcend it because from the passing of our mother and everything, it, may, it it gave me more faith. It made me realize that I, you know, I'm, I need him more than just when I need something. I need him every day. Yeah, and so, yeah, yes, yeah, yeah. yes. So that, you know, that whole thing without getting that feeling or, or getting that faith, I wouldn't have, I wouldn't have took my mom's passing as good as I have taken it. Because, you know, I have always thought in life, if I ever lose my mother, it will break me. I wouldn't be any more good. I would be torn down. I wouldn't be able to function. And, but I was, I was, I was hurt. And of course, I was selfish because you want your loved ones with you. But guess what? I had an understanding and that understanding transcended me to learn to want to learn more about him to, to talk to him more not just when I need something but when it's on my heart like I said I'll be in the bathroom in the shower and all of a sudden mm, I'll say something to him I'll spark a conversation or, or, or I ask him to give me strength or because I don't know what tomorrow may bring I don't know what today may bring you know so I you know it's just like I can't, I can't even speak on, I can't even speak on, there's no adjective that could tell you how I feel. You know what I'm saying? It's, Sometimes it's, it's, it might it's never be, but as long as, yes. you, long as you're okay with it. I just and, know how I feel. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Just, I can't explain it. You know, it's something, I can't explain it. You know, like Kirk Buck and Say Six, I, I can't feeling. explain it. Jesus, your love is so what? It's, it's so, so amazing. amazing. It's it getting high up, up to the sky. Hey, it's talking about never come the, back. The, 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 talking about no, no, do no, what? Jump. jump. <laughs> and that's how I do. Woo! Make me bow my head. Yes. That's and that's and and, 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 and and that's that's it right there. That's it right there. That's all I need. That's all I need sometimes. No, that's I'm all I need. I, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Well, I'm, I'm, I am, man, when I say God has been good to me. Has been has, good to us, has our been good family. To us, our family. I know we ain't went through things, but just yes. personally, I know he's not going to make us do, make us go through nothing we don't supposed to go through. Nothing we don't have to go, go through. through. And there's a reason behind everything. And I'm go I'm gonna be okay, and she's gonna be okay. We all and my gonna boys be okay. gonna be okay. My family's gonna be okay. We're gonna, we gonna be okay. You know what I'm saying? Handle, we know how to get through it. He helping us handle things, and, and and I believe he got. I believe he has something not just for us planned, but he has something for the whole world. He ha he has something planned for each and every individual. Everybody that is a child of God, he has something planned for you. So don't think that he just doing this for one person. He ain't doing it for you. He's he doing, doing it for, for everybody. Because we all God's children. We whether you all God's be children. Not, whether you whether you're doing be bad, not. evil, you're God's child. And with this video, this particular video, I take whatever bad comment 
that a person going to put in here, oh, you need to stop talking about. No, I'm not. Excuse me. No, I'm not. Move on to the vlog. But guess, because this is a positive vibe. This is a positive channel. Good vibes and glory to God, honey. And, and yeah, I do it just on Mondays because I give it to you every day. Because that's just how I'm feeling. But I decided to do it on this one day. You know what I'm saying? And if I'm not feeling it, I might not come to you. I may not say one word on a Monday. You may not even get it because I'm just not. But I feel, you know what I'm saying? I, it's, whew, it's overpowering. It's so overpowering. But it's a good kind. It's a good kind. You know what I'm saying? It's not too much, but it's just enough. And that's how, and that's how it is. So, guys, with that being said, again, I hope you guys love my morning thoughts. I hope I'm not offending anyone. I don't talk, I do not do this to offend anyone. I do this to release myself, to let people know how I'm feeling and how I'm changing. It may be slow, but it's happening. You know what it, I'm it, saying? It doesn't matter how slow it is or how it, 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 I, it. I can feel the trans, the transcending. I can feel the transition that I that I had made with him. I feel, but first of all, I'm gonna tell you, I feel the faith in my heart. I never felt that before. I never felt closer to him than I have in these last months. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I will always say, "Oh yeah, I believe in God." I never, never say I never do it, but I never had so much faith and never been so open to figure out what's my next journey gonna be. Where is he gonna take me next? I, I'm 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 so open to this, and, and I'm not afraid. I'm not afraid anymore. I'm not afraid. Oh, oh, I know I'm leaning on oh, all that time. Woo, all the fat that's leaning on her. Oh, <laughs> don't fall asleep. <laughs> I made her all fall asleep. <laughs> yeah, but um, with that being said, don't be upset. Cause I think if people get upset, why you get upset if I want to talk about God? What's wrong with me talking about him? Why do that upset? If that upset you, then guess what? You need There's to something wrong with you. There's something wrong with you. You need to question yourself. Why somebody else talking about um our savior, the person that the reason why you wake up every day, why is, why does it make you upset to hear about him? Because guess what? That means you need to you, you may need to touch in. You may need to touch in. And no matter what. Like I said, these videos not here to change anybody's mind. I mean, it's all this is right now. This is about me. This is about my spiritual journey and how me and my family doing. And if this could touch anybody, so be it. If it could touch anybody, so be it. Let it. Like I said, everybody don't get their journey at the same time. They no. journey to God. Everybody don't get it the same time. No, you get it when you're supposed to get it. And He will lead you to it. And you'll know it. Right? Amen. Amen to that. All right, y'all. We are out again. I hope you enjoyed this morning. Thought, you know, like I said, I take the good with the bad these days. And I'm up on the positive side of everything. That's how I'm trying to live my life positively, good by, and the faith and walk with God. And, Amen. And I am out. And to my next video, hit, um, like, share, subscribe. Hit that bell to be what? Notified. Notified. Hit that all. And enjoy my uh, enjoy my Sober Tea vlogs. Enjoy my Sober Tea channel. Go check out my sister, New Life Journey. And check out our channel called Sisterhood. Because we doing this thing, God. We doing this game. We want a journey. And we trying to do a strong. We trying to be positive, And we just trying to... Man, we're just trying to trying to be the best in us. Yes, that we can be. That we could be. And our mom may be proud. And then the, to make our mom so proud of us, because I know she's looking down on us. Like, look at my baby. Here. Yes. All right. I'm out, guys.